It's your boy King Nation over Slate and over Chronicles. It's your boy Dysfunctional, Dysfunctional's World. And today we'll do by request uh, Aquarius Man and Aries Woman. Well, so. an Aquarius man is one of a kind who follows his own path. He's a bit moody, and but generally, generally, he can find himself being calm and generous and affectionate. The Aries woman is, is impulsive. Very impulsive. Loves all her privileges of being a woman. Yes. And she's enthusiastic. He's innocent. Makes her fall in love. Mm, 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 mm. So, uh, I actually can touch up on the Aries woman. Uh, the pressure is there. Like, if you're a shy guy, or you're nervous, or you're trying to figure things out, she gonna, she gonna, she gonna let you know what time it is. If she like you, she will raise the heat with she's a fire sign on you and let, her, let you know that you pretty much ain't got to say too much of anything if she likes you. Like, there's no games or nothing or no shy play with her. She going to come get you because she wants you. She feel like she's woman. She's woman. I am definition of woman. Nobody else in the Zodiac is more certified than I am. Just let you know I am woman. Queen and, man is very understanding and generous. Yes, and I, I just feel like uh, the Aquarius man uh, want to conquer the world. This is a situation where he's going to be running into a world where the God is that willing to, you know what I'm saying, let him know that he might not be the boss or he might not be able to conquer this world. And mm -hmm. the only problem I see with these two matches is she get bored of him or he's too hesitant. Because she is impulsive? Yes, because she's going to put the pressure on him. When you put pressure on anybody, like you really get to see them at their most uh, vulnerable and yes. Yeah, the weakest point. Uh, and if the Aquarius man is at, uh, at, at a stable where he's uh, very comfortable with himself, very confident, then I think it will work. But if he's at a point where he don't know what to do, the pressure's coming. Like, I dated a, a, a Aries woman, and uh, it's kind of like you shut up and you listen. Hmm. And if you're thinking about something, it's too late. Wow. You need to move. If you're not moving, if you're not having action, or you're not uh, being consistent right then, moving fast and, and, and setting the tone, then she will do it. And it ain't no, uh, I'm the man, I'm going to lead type of thing, maybe. No, you got to know. You got to know what you're going to do. And uh, with the Aquarius man trying to conquer the world and being more laid back, it could fit into areas because all you got to do is follow that flow and it could work. But if he if she find disinterest in him, uh, you better hope that Aquarius man's uh, natural zodiac to not be so serious mm. is there, because she can leave him on the doorstep. He not know what happened. Wow. All right. So what do you give it? The Aquarius woman is a tornado. You either go with her flow, or you gonna fly all over the. Islands and everything else with the pre. So it's a hard one. It kind of okay. depends on the Aquarius man. Okay. Because if the Aries woman like you, she's going to set the world on fire with you. You ain't got to do too much of nothing. Just kind of be in the, in, the, in, the, in the confine of what she wants. And the you, Yeah, yeah. But uh, if you got weak feelings, sensitive, uh, Insecurity, yeah. any that stuff like that, that, she might kick you in the look. She might kick you in the mouth because she gonna feel like that's. Sorry about that. She gonna feel like that's a slap in the face for her to like you, and you don't even know if you like yourself. So, uh, with these two, uh, this is a hard one. What you give it? I give it a two. You give it a two? Oh, uh, it's a hard one. Cause right there in the middle. It kind of depends on that man, like. Air, uh, Aquarius, like, are you sure of yourself? Are you confident? You gonna need cockiness. You gonna need everything in, the, in your in your, your yeah, blood department. Plus, to deal with Aries woman, her tone she set so fast and so fiery. It's like if you weak minded, you can get drained out. But okay, I'm a, I'm assume optimism. The Aquarius man got his stuff on on top. He's Superman trying to conquer the world. So I will give it a. A two thumbs up. Okay. So we're pretty even. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming the Aquarius man on point. But Aquarius man, you weak, you in for a long horizon because she's not. So, this is your boy King Ace, No Slayton, No Chronicles. This is your boy Dysfunction, Dysfunction's World. Don't forget to check out King Dis on your iTunes, Google, all your streaming sites. And don't forget to check out I Fell for Juliet on Amazon. We will do a special Zodiac for I Fell for Juliet. Uh, got some Tauruses in there, got some Virgos in there, uh, some Scorpios. It should be pretty fun to break it down, but I want to let people read the book a little bit more before I break that down. Uh, you can find it on Amazon. Uh, you can Google it and find it wherever site you want. Press release, everything. So, this is your boy, Keen Ace, Nova Slate, Nova Chronicles. Dysfunctional, dysfunctional world. Peace. Peace.